following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Missouri of the Brawling Brutes. And his opponent, representing the Brawling Brutes from Birmingham, England, weighing in at 205 pounds. Butch! Butch in the ring and ready to get this fight started. That's exactly what it's going to be, Cole. A fight. Butch doesn't concern himself with the destination. He's focused on the journey. And his idea of a journey is one that inflicts pain and suffering. I thought his brute brethren were unhinged and violent until they introduced us to Butch. I would liken Butch to an animal, Corey, but I don't think animals fight with the hollow vitriol that Butch does. And Cody Rhodes will meet him across the ring, something that many fans still find to be a surprising reality. Cody wants from the top. And that stops what Butch had intended. Big forearm. I can't imagine what is going through your head. When you're facing off against an opponent as unhinged as Butch. Well, if you're not careful, it'll be Butch's fist that goes through your head. You can't out brawl him. And trying to match his intensity will run your tank dry in a hurry. I'd say no. Oh, straight to the floor. An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk was worth it. Tap! with a timely counter. Oh, right to the throat. Nasty. Five. And he's taking this to the outside now. He climbs into the ring. He's lost some of his win now. Grabbing a hold of the arm. Oh, an arm breaker. Pulverizing the arm is a great way to create an advantage. Basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. Crank in the head. Cody looking to attack from above. Uh oh. Way too much. Oh, diving moonsaults. Cody is picking the opposition apart. Wow. Which is short fuse leading to mistakes as his opponent takes advantage. And there was some force on that move. Away, living to fight another day. What is Cody Rhodes looking for here? Oh my! Drives them down with a vertebra breaker. Perfectly delivered, and Cody's gambles are paying off. Put all your chips on the table and let it ride on Rhodes. Uh oh, monkey flip! <laughs> I love it. Slips out of the way. Cody Rhodes hooks him up. I see a cut two on Butch after that. Butch in big time jeopardy. Two count. It's over. All in a nice work. Here is your winner. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was his... Down tag Team Champions, Kevin Owens! My best. John Cena! Let's do it! It seems like even when Kevin Owens isn't in the ring to host a segment of his talk show, he still transforms any stage he is on into the KO show. And Kevin Owens creep. Penny predicament, shoulders down. He's looking to get this match won in short order. Hurricane. Oh, close line. Cena letting his opponent. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Take down, put him in the cross face, hits the cross face. I'm gonna tap out of here. We're gonna free the arm and does just that.
There it is. Snap suplex. And we're down to the proverbial wire here, guys. The match hanging in the balance. Time to get back in the ring. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. According to Kevin Owens, what do you have to do tonight that will be different from previous encounters with Cena? KO knows that Cena has studied him at length. So I think we'll see Owens do something he's never done before. Perhaps employ a new strategy, maybe a new maneuver, something that did not come up on Cena's scouting report. Into the suplex. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. From the middle rope. Oh, a splash. Boom, in the cover. Kick out of that. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. What a shot. Turn it around to hit a DDT with authority. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Face Buster plants it. It's that time again. Time for the five knuckle shuffle. The five knuckle shuffle. Cena showing he can still get the job done. Not just get it done, Saxton. Get it done with authority. It could be over here. This is it. Instantly, he has his shoulders up. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Elbow on the spot. Knees up, had that telegraph, but can it be capitalized on? DDT plants that. And he's able to counter. Cena! Oh, just That's it. I think KO might be out. Two! Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. Kevin Owens tapping deep into his reserve. Sew this up. There's two. He can get it too. You can never say that John Cena doesn't bring everything he has to every fight. Case in point. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. And Cena pops the shoulder up. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? Kick to the midsection, sunset flip for the win. There's two. What a match. Cena ready to call it. Has Owens in perfect position. Cena has him up. Is that all Cena needs? Is it enough? Amazing. Owens showing that he didn't come here to be beat. He's here for a fight. And Cena shot. But we know that kick out has only made him more determined. Vicious arm stop. Hooked up in a pump handle. And neck breaker. Hands. That was nasty. He saw it coming for Owens. Kick to the midsection. Sunset flip. Cena looking to put this thing away. It is locked in. STF applied. This one could be over. It's Kevin Owens going to tap. Got oh. nowhere to go. Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Uh oh. And over to him to reverse it. This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck breaker. Gosh. Had <laughs> that one scouted. These two having an answer for everything. These two battling. Take it over. Go for the win here.
despite Kevin Owens' best efforts, big match, John strikes again. What a match, what a battle between Cena and KO. Two men who certainly see this business differently, but can make absolute magic in this squared circle together. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. And his opponent, from Dudley, England, weighing in at 107. A third generation wrestler, Randy Orton, has proven himself time and time again as a paragon of a superstar. Very few superstars look as relaxed and at home in the ring as Orton. Like you said, Cole, he was born for this. I don't think there's anywhere he'd rather be than in the ring tearing opponents apart. That natural talent and ferociousness have certainly earned him confidence. We'll see if he carries that into the ring here tonight. And he's facing off against Tyler Bate, who has put his own unique twist on British Strong Style. He's a little young and still a little inexperienced, but he may well be pound for pound one of the strongest superstars in WWE today. I mean, I'm calling the big strong boy for nothing, son. They're about a submission here, guys. Lost and crab. The pressure's on. What a unique submission maneuver here. Trying to free himself. Trips the ankle and he's out. And kicks off his opponent. <laughs> Tyler Bate, a young competitor who has already accomplished so much. Does that make him harder to defeat? It absolutely does, Cole. Bate has the confidence and stamina of youth. He's taken much bigger superstars to the limit, but the longer the match goes, even if he starts to run out of steam. If you want to beat him, you have to be ready to outlast him. And a big-time knee drop. Mind games in full effect from the Apex Predator. Boom! What a punch! Look at Orton here. Launches. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just got to toss another person to make a statement. Fans off the attack with an elbow. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Able to evade. Tyler Bate looking to lock it in. Billy goes curse. Well, Viper. It Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Sight set on the top rope. showing he has the ability to outlast him. It's going to be a long night for Bate. Uh-oh. Look at this. Uh-oh is right. into the ring. How's that for a counter? Running Hurricane Rana! And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Close fist connects. Oh no, I think that one broke the skin on Bates' face. sweat. First 
is here. The following contest. They call Gunther the ring general, a moniker he earned for the impressive combat tactics he employs in his matches. Tactics which can be as devastating as they are genius. You could easily mistake Gunther. Penny predicament. He needs a little more than that to end things this early. Look at this. Snap suplex. Placed in the corner. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Gunther moved at the right time. And there was some force on that move. Ugh, kick finds it. Oh, what impact. Oh, that's going to hurt. Take down. Put it in the crossbow. And the Wolves break this one up. Great ring awareness there. Stomping. Ouch. He's returning fire. Just a force of nature to contend with. When you're taking on a mastermind like Seth Rollins, the most important thing to remember is that you have to take away his ability to control the match. Pace is a good place to start. If Rollins wants things fast, slow him down. If he tries to be methodical, start out running it. Yeah, owning the tempo here can definitely fluster Rollins. Continued assault from Raw. Oh, putting that strain on. This won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment. We're gonna free the arm and does just that. No! Oh, taking it right to him. No way. Rollins making perfectly clear who the visionary is in this match. Come on. No one likes a count out. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Some stiff offense. That shows you the ring general's genius in action. Driving a knee into the arm. The 
official. If the ref was more honest, there would be no need to cheat. He was waiting for him to make his move. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole, his opponent included. By the throat into the top rope. Oof. Oh, he knew what was coming. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Looking wobbly in the corner. Dodged right off cue. See an answer for every move attempted. Huge burning Larry. And Gunther clearly not impressed by his opponent thus far. He has him right where he wants him. And he's taking this to the outside now. And he tosses him back in now. Rollins escaping danger. DDT! Right. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. Rolling elbow right on the mark. And plenty of damage continues to mount on Guther. This right here is a testament to the sheer willpower of Seth Rollins. Face first! And he sends him into the corner. From the middle run into the stomp! Is it enough to overcome Gunther? Shoulders down. And he's still in the game. Gunther is down, but not out. Such a competitive drive, refusing to let this be over. And Rollins not handling this well. That was it, for all he knew. But it wasn't. This is truly awesome. The ring general. Call. I don't know how he survived that. And Guther definitely thought that. Guther wants to finish this. <laughs> so much brutality with that move tonight. Guther secures the win. Here is your winner, Guther. He really wanted this one bad. Yeah, what a major win for him here. I strongly suggest Seth Rollins dedicate some more time to doing homework on his opponent. There's a lot of notes he can take from tonight. Hey, Seth Rollins is a true student. And his opponent, from West Newberry, Massachusetts, Kicking things off with Cody Rhodes. It's been a long, strange road home for the American Nightmare, but Cody Rhodes has made it clear that he's not about the past anymore. He's back in WWE to cement his legacy and finish the task he started. It's all or nothing time for the grandson of a plumber. All or nothing indeed as Rhodes looks to take a big step here tonight. And he has his work cut out for him as John Cena will no doubt be putting in the work in this match. Not an exception. It's the rule of law when it comes to someone with the resolve and determination of Cena. Not that there are many others with that same level of drive as him. Oh, uh -oh. oh Cody anticipated that. Hooked up. Oh, shit breaker. Now, that'll do some serious damage. What is it that makes Cena such a unique success story inside the ring? How does he always seem to find the advantage? What sets Cena apart is his ability to shift gears in the middle of a match. Once he shifts into that next gear, and believe me, he will. We all know what he does. There might not be any stop. Time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain pressure. Boom! 
John Cena with a rough blow there. Counters that. Cody Rhodes finding a way to slow his opponent's assault down. Cody isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put an end to him. Cody has him up. Throw the breaker. Cover. There's two. What a match. Cody Rhodes lining it up. Turn inside out with a desperation clothesline. And he kicks out of the pin in one. Still not enough to put him away. He catches Cena with a counter. in John Cena to let it end like that. Never give up indeed. You gotta wonder what more Cody has to do to put him away here. Uh-oh. Suicide dive! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. From the top. Dive handle. You can see it in these superstars' faces. They're in serious pain at the moment. A lot of punishment has been dished out, but no one is thinking about quitting. Cena now taking the brunt of the attack. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. He's one step ahead there. Cena's never give up attitude shining through once again. A double leg drop. Ranking back on the hold. Can't see his opponent and survive. Whoa, wait a second. What a counter. Dreaded maneuvers in all of sports entertainment drives them down with a vertebra breaker. Devastating maneuver from the American. Cody Rhodes has his opponent up and wants it. That could end Cena right now. Rhodes looking to end this. Rhodes and making their best shot. Lots more. There's two. I'm shaking my head in disbelief over how he made. Cena connected there. Two count. One kick out. I don't believe it. The never ending fight in Cody Rhodes. Absolutely undeniable right now. And Cena has to hammer down now. He was only inches away from gaining the three count. Able to avoid there. Pulled in for a point. Ah, oh, John Cena. Ah, oh, John Cena. Has him where he wants him. You can't see me. This is vintage Cena. The five knuckle. And there's the cover. Still only got one. There is no quit in this man tonight. We're reaching a point where these superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's going to find a way to capitalize on that vulnerability? Hits him with the counter. Big close line. Don't do it. Suicide dive. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Cody Rhodes with a great block of cover. Cover. Two. Cena's still in it. The muscle memory's got to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. 
The American Nightmare. Can that keep Cena down? That's gotta be it. There's two. What in the world? Cena kicks out. I mean, he doesn't say never give up to nothing, guys. This is what John Cena is made of. Never give up isn't a catchphrase. It's Cena's way of life. Disbelief in the face of the American Nightmare. What's he gonna have to do to put this away? Cody Rhodes hooks him up. And now I see some blood on the face of Cena. The big gun fired yet again. Two. And Cody Rhodes picks up the W. Here is your winner. Cena lost. <laughs> Mr. Never Give Up. Lethal superstar in WWE history. The following, and his opponent, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria. And Guther is a true throwback, guys. He reminds me of the great old-school champions who revolutionized this sport in the last century. If by that you mean he'll beat the crap out of you and not bat an eyelash, then sure. Gunther is a double-tough and absolutely ruthless competitor in the ring. If you don't respect him, you will fear him, and either works for him. Yep, that about sums it up. But it's so remarkable how his opponent, Randy Orton, has continued to grow and evolve even 20 years into his career. As his mentor once said, evolve or perish. Orton's always learning, finding things to improve, and actually approving upon them. He's as much a spy. Okay, we're going for the win. Others are down for the victory. Vicious right forearm. Counter on Guther pays off. to the ring. He's turning the tables. On the apron. What? We've seen Guther stop people dead in their tracks with a single thunderous blow. How do you deal with an opponent like him? You have to weaken him all while making yourself a hard target. So be selective with your attacks and try to land blows to the legs or midsection. That'll help cut the big man down to size. Guther quick to the counter. And a nice takedown. Elbow thrown to break up the maneuver. to good use with a precision strike. The Vipers lined up his prey. We know what's next. It's over. Guthers done. Hit and stop by rope break. Was mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Boom! And he slides him back to the mat. Orton measuring him. Uh -oh. Answers back on Orton. Nice snap, Mayor. Ooh, a chop. Oh, boom! Him. Here he goes for the win! Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Suplex. Oh. Here it comes. Nicely done. Cannot be 
Chase Lane here tonight. And Guther definitely thought that would put him down. I can't imagine he's going to take it easy on him after such a defiant kick out. He moved, but can he capitalize? Legs caught. Close line takes him down. Forget about it. and he's able to kick out before a one count? It's stunning. And that was an effective attack, guys. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. Devastating kick. Uppercut connects. And that one's scouted. Back and forth, back. This. I can't believe the nerve he's got interrupting this matchup. You shouldn't be surprised, Saxton. This superstar only cares about one person himself. Oh, out. Watch out, watch out! Great reversal. You have to sense that fatigue is starting to become a factor at this point. Make no illusions on it. This is coming down to a battle of attrition. The suspense this crowd is feeling is palpable. They are really with baited. Distraction had catastrophic repercussions throughout the match. Yeah, they put up a good fight. The following contest is a six-man battle royal. And his opponents, first from Dudley, England, weighing in the bruiser of the brawling boots. And representing the and from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 200. Freaking Rollins, the visionary and the revolutionary of WWE. Here and representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297. This highly anticipated battle royal has begun. A very cold fight in the back of the net. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Oh, he fights bait back. Oh, Jared with the torture round. Oh, Gunther wants to finish this. Oh, he fends off the attack. Big opening for Gunther to take this. But he oh, to the neck. Kick to the next section prevents the attack. These two battling to a dead heat with these reverses. And he's able to counter. Oh, Funny leg drop. Coming attack 
with a knee to the face. And responds with a counter of their own. And did you hear the impact of that? Gunther pays off. There's Cena. Fails to connect on the springboard. Owens cannot recover from that. No quarter being given by either competitor. You have to believe this was going to be decided by the smallest of margins. He's adamant about that shot. after coming out on top in a match like this. Accomplishment. Has seen and done everything there is to do in this that business. Anticipated championship match set to begin. We've seen few superstars as cold blooded as the Apex Predator Randy Orton. There's something deeply disturbing when he locks his eyes on his opponent. Yeah, it's definitely chilling at times, Michael, but we've also seen a softer side to Randy in recent years, which I, for one, really enjoy seeing. Yeah, Byron, but I wouldn't dare view that softer side as weakness. If anything, that's just how Orton draws his prey in closer. And Cody Rhodes will meet him across the ring, something that many fans still find to be a surprising reality. Cody once came at the King and lived to tell the tale. But really, it makes perfect sense. Cody Rhodes believes in himself. He will bet on himself every single time, and more often than not, it pays off. Damn. Boom! What an uppercut! Oh, shot right to the kidney! And again! Great win, you're down your opponent. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Rhodes gets out of dodge. Precision strike to the back of the neck. Randy Orton seems less intense than we've known him to be, Corey. Has the Viper lost? Here's the pen. Title on the line. He kicks out with authority. A little over eager with that cover. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. And that's enough to shake anybody's belief in themselves, even Cody Rhodes. Yeah, and Orton showed he hasn't lost an ounce of that killer instinct. He'll take things into the ring. Yeah. Oh, costly error there. Ooh, kick right to the gut. But Piper able to strike back. Oh, 
after that move, Orton can see the victory in his mind. I don't think you can ever know what's really in Orton's mind, Saxton. He steers clear of contact. Cody Rhodes hooks him up. That just put down the Viper. Is it enough? Kick out before the one count. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Rhodes hoped for victory dash for the time being, but you know he won't settle for long. And that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. in that area could leave him dizzy. Oh, man. Able to reverse that one. Saw that coming. Punch lands. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Merciless attacks from the Viper. I've said it before and I'll say it again. When you take your eyes off Orton like that, he'll make you pay the price. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. You have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. <laughs> A familiar, gruesome sight on the face of the American Nightmare. How did he do that? Orton has ended so many matches with that, but it did not do the trick just then. Had the Viper scouted. Orton into a rough landing on the outside. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Whoa. Oh! Two! Just mounted with punches and not and a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Grabbing a hold of the arm. Oh, it dropped. Getting back into the ring. Five. Ooh, man. Yeah. Dropping the elbow. Sent off from the apron.
What a shift into the tides with this championship match. Tonight is definitely a night to celebrate, but let's not lose sight of the fact they have a long road ahead of them now. At least, if they're lucky. Oh, come on, Corey. Don't be such a party pooper. We've got a new champion.